the additional damage is not affected by some status change. Okay, what the freak is this? How's it going guys? In today's video, I'm gonna react to Signal Suit, Cyrus and Darkrai. He is Dark Tech and I'm pretty sure he has uh, Dark Zone. I think, I think that's obvious, right? So, week to bug... Maybe... Fairy, okay, makes sense. Pocket Fair, right? Yeah, he's Pocket Fair. Dark Tech, Signal Tech, Signal Suit Tech, Scarf Tech and Villain Tech. Okay, stats... HP pretty good, attack probably irrelevant. Special attack is really high. Holy crap, speed is also very high. Oh, okay. Defense with defense is okay. Sync snooze puts all opponents to sleep after sync move. Oh, okay. That is pretty good. Okay. Bad break 9 on is this. So you minus one of the four. So you minus one stat for all the following. Okay, wait, wait. You minus one stat randomly, I guess. Yeah, randomly. When the user's Pokemon uses a status move, okay. Or oh, it, it decreases all opposing sync press. Okay, that is interesting. Using a status move, so he has like Dark Void, I think. Yeah, Dark Void, Dark Void. Shared Nightmare, okay, what is this? Deals additional damage to all opposing sync pairs that are asleep when the user's Pokemon uses a move. Type Dark Category Special. This additional damage is not affected by some status change. Okay, what the freak is this? Deals the additional damage. How much is the additional damage? What is how much is that? We don't even know what's the additional damage. Okay, cool. Let's look at the moves. Dark Void makes sense. 80% accuracy. I thought it's 50. Hold on. Yeah, it's actually 50%. It was like nerfed, right? It was nerfed to 50 because it was too OP in uh, VGC, I think. Okay, Dark Wish. Okay, makes sense. Dark Pulse. Okay. 20% chance of flinch. Perpetual Nightmare plus 2 special attack plus 1 crit and accuracy so we can max out with uh, MPR Interesting Oh wait hold on Ah uh, so he can randomly minus the stats every time he uses Dark Void right? Okay that makes sense It doesn't say it has to be successful right so you can just keep spamming it to debuff I guess Deals additional damage uh, I don't know what this means. I mean, I know what it means, but like how much damage actually? Okay, interesting. This, addi this additional damage is not affected by some status changes. Okay, I don't, I don't really get this actually. The heck. Perfect World Dark Pulse. Increases damage when Dark Zone. Okay, makes a lot of sense. No doubt he's gonna do a lot of damage. Okay, overall I think he's solid. Special attack stat is very high. Can AoE sleep? Very useful. Dark Wish is very useful. Can buff characters like... uh. Karen Houndoom, I guess. And Sync is probably gonna do a lot of damage as well. So yeah, let's move on to Sync Grid. Okay, so 1 out of 5. Dark Wish MGR, that's useless. Wide Awake, okay, okay, 1 out of 5, nothing much. Kinda sad. Dark Void MGR 4, okay. Fast Track 4, okay. Grand Entry, okay, interesting. Equity, okay. Umbro, Acceleration 2. Okay, uh, faster move gauge in Dark Zone. MGR 3 for Dark Pulse, okay. Aggravation 1, okay. Nothing imp nothing crazy at the moment. But you plus 1 accuracy, you don't even need that. You can just plus 1 accuracy from trainer move. 3 out of 5. Cool Nightmare 5, okay. So preparation 1, 30% chance to apply. So boom. To play 15 up next. Uh, okay. Power play. Ooh. Okay. The more the target stats are lower, the more the powers up. Oh my god. That is. Okay. That is going to be quite a lot of damage. Bad break one. So 20% chance to debuff. Okay. Oh, another, so it already has a 100% chance. And then another, another 20% chance to minus two. Or maybe like minus one special attack and then minus one special defense or something. Okay. Unbrow power three. Okay. That was MPR two. Okay. Dark power good nightmare five. Okay. Crit strike two. Okay. Not bad. Not bad. Okay. Let's. I still have no idea what is like the passive thing. Shared nightmare. No idea like how much damage multiplier. Yeah. Imagine it imagine if it's double. That is crazy actually. 
Okay, I guess you can do. Oh, I'll have to take grand entry too. Oh man, maybe you can just do this. Yeah, it's actually cheaper to do this. NPR 2, and then you can probably max out crit and special attack, I guess. Dark Pulse, Good Nightmare, Crit Strap 2. I don't know why there's Good Nightmare here and Good Nightmare there again. Interesting. So, yeah, I guess something like this. Actually, hold on, remove Crit Strap 2, you take this instead. 30% increase. Okay, this might be a pretty good build for him. No MGR 3, but then his speed is not bad, so. It's fine, it's only 3 gauge, not 4 gauge, so it should be fine, I think. Okay, let's look at the damage, it's gonna be a lot. Let's assume we just get it, get it to minus 3 special attack. Dark zone, we crit, and then we effective dark. Plus 6 special attack. Wow, holy crap. Oh, that is a lot of damage. It's only a minus 3. Let's see if we minus 3 the other stats. Minus 3. 47,000. That is a lot of damage. If you minus special defense, that's gonna be even more damage. Oh my god. The, pot the potential damage of this thing is very high. Let's get accuracy, I guess. Evasion. Oh, already caps. So it caps at 18 debuffs. Okay. And then with Dark Wish. Okay, that is a lot of damage. Dark Pulse is 8400, also a lot of damage. Dang. And it's also quite easy to set up as well. You can just spam Dark Void, I guess, to make them sleep. And then, uh, Dark Void is also AoE, so that is very nice. And then, yeah, it's very easy to set up. You just make it sleep and then set up Dark Zone and then you just do big damage. Very, very solid, especially right now when we don't have much Dark, uh, dark Damage Dealer, right? Dark Ride is very good. Easily the best like dam uh, dark damage dealer, right? I think it's worth the pull, definitely. Maybe you can even just pull for Dark Wish because Dark Wish is a really good move. So basically, you can also buff like other dark types as well. So guys, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed, make sure to like, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video.